I'm here at KGNU Radio in Boulder, Colorado, getting ready to help Maeve Conran, one of the um, hosts of the radio shows and news here, to get her office reorganized. She inherited it from people who were kind of messy, and she's had a child and very busy and just has not been able to get it cleaned out. So this will be really fun. So come join us. And this is Maeve. Introduce yourself, Maeve. Hello, I'm one of the news directors here at Yay. KGNU. And I inherited this office and uh, never quite cleared out all the stuff that's been here for many years from other people. And now I'd like to have this as a space that I can use for myself. Right. There's evidence of lots of old technology that we used to use in radio that we don't use anymore. Everything's yeah. digitized, so we don't really need to... No, we want to keep some stuff for the archives, but we don't need everything. So, so, so this is a good example of an office that someone inherited. Mm -hmm. Yay. And I would never... I just never got around to, yeah. you know, and you start your job and then it's just, you know, you get busy. And yeah. Then and so you sit down at the desk and you just work. Yeah. And how much of that is even your stuff? No, this is mine. And I actually am a bit organized. Like I have my files. Mm -hmm. This is kind of my inbox, which isn't too bad. And I do go through it every day. Mm -hmm. It's just a few things. They're my papers. And that will all kind of go out. That's my baby sometimes comes to work with me. She sits there when I remove Aww, some of the stuff. Very good. And then just some stash stuff. This would definitely be clearer. Yep, yep. We'll go through everything. So it's not too bad. I'm actually, I'm not overwhelmed with my own specific yeah. workspace. So but even it's all the other stuff. Yeah. And so it's even stuff like uh, behind your desk is yes. a big uh, map of Baghdad yeah. and the BBC stuff of the Middle East. And like, is that yours? No, it's not. And yeah. I, you know, I'm kind of sick looking at Baghdad. I think I know what Baghdad looks like. And this is old Baghdad. I mean, this yeah. doesn't even represent. <laughs> I know Baghdad has changed. You know what I mean? Right. I, you know, if I had military bases on there and yeah. like, the greens on that would be one thing. But this is like yeah. when Hussein was there. Yeah. And, so, so it may be that when we take that down, you don't put anything there. I mean, yeah. it's just, it's your space then to make I lovely a mirror there oh oh yeah a mirror there I you go wouldn't mind a mirror. okay so that's just the you thing see people coming in because i have my back to the door yeah. so it's a little bit disconcerting people yeah come in behind me. so that's the thing about organizing is you want to make your space your space mm -hmm. you want to make it so that it loves you back yes. so that you love being in it so what we're going to do is we're going to just jump in piece basically by piece. with organizing you just go ch chunk i call mm -hmm. it chunk and chip so you take this chunk and say, keep or leave, does it belong here or not? Yeah. If it doesn't belong here, where does it go? We've then you boxes. take your trusty prep boxes and you put it in it and it has to go somewhere. And this is a radio station, so it has either it's technology that's too old and it gets donated and it's out mm -hmm. of here. Or the guy next door. Oh, here, we have to go look at the guy next door. He's going to kill me. I'm Evan. Evan. Okay, we're going to... Okay, this is... Oh, Evan's not in here, so we can do... He won't even know. Evan, hi, Hello. Evan. <laughs> we were just showing your office that this is where things get fixed. This is where things get fixed, And yes. it may be a graveyard for some things, yeah. right? Well, yeah. the, part of the problem with the, the electronics is that we don't want to just throw them out right so we want to have them recycled but that costs yes so we just sort of keep them until we have a critical mass that makes it worthwhile good and then ship them all off at once right so some of the things out of this office you may end up getting probably that's because fine. maybe that's there's fine, pieces or yeah. whatever and make a terminator yeah. robot out of it later or you know i just <laughs> i just go. watched terminator this weekend so. yeah, exactly, exactly. <laughs> hopefully they will not gain sentience yes and start building themselves <laughs> great all right so make sure that you have, and here we have right here, it says office paper and recycle. Yes, yeah, my so recycle. So always have that. You have a real trash can for real trash. Yep. And then boxes, tubs, bins, whatever. Here on the outside, we have the bin for my coats on it there um, for paper. Recycling. Yep. Yeah. So make sure you have those prep boxes ready to go because if you don't, you get stuck because then where do you put it? And here Maeve is already dusting. So being able to have your cleaning supplies is very important so that you can just clean it up while you go and then it's really nice and everything is feels good. Okay. Okay, so under here and everything's uh, taken out and not so messy. It's all nice and clean and organized now. And there's not much because there doesn't need to be right now. But on the left here is some teas and some oatmeal. Um, and so that's something to get a nice basket or possibly a plastic covered bin that, that fits better. up there. Yeah. yeah. So they stay nice and clean, dust free. And then you can just pull the whole thing out when you need to get your teas and stuff. Yep, great. Now should I back to you? So one of the things we'll want to do too, and this is very important, is to make a staging area. 
So this is, you know, you can even take a box and just put it all in there just to get it off for right now. And then you kind of wipe that space off and then that becomes your staging area to do the work on from everything else you pull off the shelves. And that way it doesn't get all mixed up. And so when you're pulling things off a shelf like this and putting them on the staging area, the, the thing to do is not to figure it out while you're doing it. Okay. The, yeah, and you just weren't. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Just your job is to just get it all off of there, there, clean the surface off, and then from the staging area, you do the deciding of yes, gotcha. no, yes, no, and then putting back. Mm -hmm. You're doing great. Okay, so in this case, it's taking a lot of CDs, cassette tapes, old um, real tapes, yeah. <laughs> spool tapes, and media, and having a volunteer here at the station go through them. And then they have to be categorized, and we'll, most will never come back in here again, no. but that's not your job to essentially have to do, so that's nice. Okay, so here we are. We've cleaned up the desk area. We've cleaned up the shelving area, so now there's just CDs, reels, and cassettes that just need to be gone through by the volunteers here at KGNU Radio, and then they can archive them or digitize them or whatever they need to do, but they will not be in here anymore. And the walls are cleaner and have Maeve stuff on them now. Yay! Baghdad is gone. Sorry, Baghdad. Yeah, bye-bye. <laughs> and now your baby... Won't be, it won't be so dusty it's and messy. As, but exactly. It was really it was just nasty. I just didn't want to bring her in here yeah. at all. And the floor is going to be the next project. I'll get that yeah. washed just because now she's yeah. a bit more mobile. Not that I want her in here too much because there's a lot of right. wires. But I just don't feel so bad about it. If something, if yeah. her sack was to drop on the floor, I would be yeah. so eked out about putting it back in the yeah. floor. So get it nice and carpet clean. We've got a lot of this stuff. Yeah, we've got that corner cleaned out. This is completely cleaned yeah, off. This is amazing. Ooh, yeah. That's another hole. Project. Exactly. Clean up this desk just a little, just to kind of get some yeah. of the stuff out of the way. So that's kind of nice. This was a huge project. I thought this would just take forever. Mm -hmm. And up there, I mean, this was the big stuff. You know, sorting out books. Now there's a place for things, so yeah. it's actually so much easier. We've created a place for books, mm -hmm. four CDs, four tapes. So. Mm -hmm. You know, anything coming into the office, there's now a space for it. So there's really no excuse for right. clutter to build up. And that's just this. Like, everything has to live somewhere. Yeah. has to have a home. has to have a cat. It's got to be in a category and a container would, yeah. and label it. That's it. Mm -hmm. So now it's just so much easier to take yeah. care of these things and really enjoy your office. It's functional, yeah. and you can use it. And, you know, it's... We've got a bucket of stuff to be donated, mm -hmm. books and uh, some bags, mm -hmm. everything else is recycling. And actually yeah. there wasn't that much trash. No, there wasn't. A lot of paper stuff and that makes it... And just a lot of dust. Just dust. Lots icky, of dust. Icky, icky. Yeah. So. And we found some treasures, stuff and that had genuinely been lost that we really needed. <coughs> They're back in our universe. Yay. Yay. Thank you. Good yeah. to be in our room. It is. Thank this you. is great. I'm just inspired now. <laughs> well, hope that's taken our picture. Yay. Yay. <gasps> we did it. <laughs> thank you, Katie and you. Yay, thank you, Kim, Dr. Declutter. <laughs> So KGNU is available online. You can listen to our shows or archived or you can listen live streaming at KGNU.org. Okay, so they can listen online. Yeah, they can listen online. Yay, so you don't have to live in Boulder no, or the or area. or Denver or anywhere. You can. We have listener members from Australia, from Europe, all over the place. People listen all the time online to our shows. And if you go to KGNU.org, you can find out the schedule of the different shows that are on. And then you can listen online. You can download shows if you miss them. Uh, listen to them afterwards. You can set up podcasts. You can listen on your iPhone. So there's all kinds of ways to listen. Great. All right. Everybody get there. There you go. <laughs> Thank you.